Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can install Window Builder plugin in your Eclipse IDE. It's also called GUI plugin and uh, this GUI plugin enables you to develop your uh, Java GUI applications in Eclipse. So let's see how we can install this uh, Window Builder plugin. So fire up your Eclipse and go to the help tab here and then go to install new software and in here in the work with space here you need to uh, click this combo box here this one and it will give you some options and what we want to choose here is http colon slash slash download.eclipse.org it will be there also in your uh, eclipse uh, also slash release slash i have uh, the latest version which is uh, luna but if you have uh, some other version it will show you that uh, version of eclipse for example juno or kepler so just select this option which says http slash download dot eclipse dot org slash release release slash whatever version of eclipse you have i have luna so i will select this luna okay and this will give you some options here what option we are interested in is called general purpose tool this one okay so just select this general purpose tool and then search for so go down a little and in here we are searching for swing designer so everything which is uh, under this sw swing designer or below this swing designer you need to check this so this is swing designer and I will check all the option below swing designer up to the end of window builder okay all these things window builder and so all these option which says window builder or swing designer you need to check okay window builder and swing designer okay and once you are selected all these options related to windows builder and swing designer what you need to do you need to just click this next button and it will calculate the requirement and dependencies it will give you this list here and you can review your items once again and click next and this is the license terms and condition you say I accept terms of license agreement and click finish and then the installation of software will start So it will take some time depending upon the, the speed of your internet and the selection of your file so if you have selected more files or more software to install it will take more time and let's see how much time it takes here if it will take uh, more time I will just pause the video and restart it uh, once it's installed So I think I will pause the video once it uh, these uh, this installation is complete and then I will continue with this video okay or it's already finishing yes it's finished okay so it says you will need to restart Eclipse for the changes to take effect would you like to restart so I will say yes I want to restart and will restart my Eclipse you see I have Eclipse Luna installed which is the latest version at the time of making this video and it will load all of your plugin you have installed
and now Eclipse has started okay so once you have uh, successfully installed these uh, window binder plugin and uh, swing designer plugin you can develop a project uh, using these uh, window builder and swing designer so how you can uh, create a new project using these uh, window builder just go to file new java project and in here uh, you will be able to see the options to make the java project but i think i should go to new and in here you should go to others here right so go to new and then it will show the options others so go to others or other and in here search for window builder so this is the window builder and in here search for swing designer and select application window okay so go to window builder swing designer and select this application window here okay and click next and now you uh, just need to give the path or uh, give the path to your uh, uh, or give the name to your project i will give the name to my project as uh, hello world project and for example i want to change this uh, location of the folder i can uh, choose the location right now i already have this project hello world here so i will not change the default location but uh, yeah i can do it with and it says type the name with same name but different case exists so i will say hello world class for example and this says the use of default package is discouraged i will uh, go and finish this and now i will have this designer tool here so it has generated me this code and when i go to this design tab it it we are right now in the source tab so when we go in the design tab we will be able to see the design view of uh, this code so this is what eclipse uh, window builder has generated for us it will take some time to uh, go into the designer view for the first time and you see we are in the design view okay so this is uh, the frame which you get whenever you create a new window builder project right you can drag and drop these uh, palette tools from uh, from this palette to the to this frame so for example i can drag and drop this j button here in order to uh, drag and drop this j button i need to have this absolute layout so this all i will uh, show in the next video but let's see what ca what can we do with this so for now i'm just going to run the blank frame here and in the later video i will show you how you can design this frame with a uh, j button or j text field or j radio button or other tools which are there in this palette so what i'm going to do is i will just run this and you will be able to see this frame which is blank right now but when we uh, design our frame with some buttons or menus and all the other things this will look uh, really interactive and you will be able to design your uh, gui with this window builder tool so i hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now